Welcome to Real Issue Podcast. I am your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, if you are a Miami Heat fan, continue to like, share, comment, subscribe. Thank you for all the support. If you're an NBA fan, subscribe to the channel. And thank you for all the support. So numerous executives think the Miami Heat don't miss Tyler Hero as much as people thought they would. Now, the article also says I've heard from a number of executives around the league saying, I don't think the Heat missed Tyler Hero as much as people thought they were going to miss Tyler Hero, Zach Lowe said. I think the Miami Heat, no one expected them to do what they're doing. Okay, the Miami Heat beat the one-seeded Milwaukee Bucks 4-1. Nobody was expecting that, okay? If you would have told me that the Miami Heat would beat the Milwaukee Bucks maybe in 6 or 7, but definitely not 4-1 and the way that we did beat the Milwaukee Bucks. We were coming... We had 10 point um you know deficit comebacks. Jimmy Butler dropping at 56. You know, guys just playing out of his mind. Uh Bam 20, 10, and 10. We played great. The role players definitely stepped up. And and to be honest, I thought that we would have had a bigger hole in our offense. But I think that with the ball movement on this team and Jimmy Butler really leading this team, I think that's really what's making up for Tyler here. Because also think about it, we lost another great guard in Victor Oladipo, a great defensive guard. So I wouldn't say that we don't miss Tyler here. I, I wouldn't say that at all because I think that some way, some way, somehow within this playoff run, we're going to see where damn Tyler Hero could have been really used tonight because to me, with Jimmy Butler with a rolled ankle going into game two and you have Tyler and Bam, maybe they can get it done. Maybe we can get game two in New York. So I think that's when we really miss Tyler Hero because think about it. Jimmy Butler can't do it all by himself. Bam out of bio has been a little bit passive. Uh, just a little bit too, I don't know, I don't know. I just don't think he's, you know, trying to really take over the game. I don't think he's really trying to, you know, make make it difficult for guys, really get to his spots, really get to his jump shot, really be aggressive, and really try to win these games. Like, I don't see him with Jimmy Butler's intensity, you know what I mean? So, to me, with Jimmy Butler now being out for game two, Tyler Hero would be great because now you can rely on your two young guys with the role players to hopefully pull out another W, especially with Randall being hurt. Now I'm hearing that Jalen Brunson, he he has like a sore ankle. So there's a lot of moments within this playoff series where Tyler Hero could have been needed. Also, too, I was really looking to see, can Tyler Hero's game translate to the playoffs? Because in game one versus the Milwaukee Bucks, he had 12 points. He was looking solid. That's really the big question, to be honest. Everybody wants to see, can we trust Tyler Hero in the playoffs? Can Tyler Hero help Bam and Jimmy? Is Tyler Hero worth keeping for the future? So these are all different questions. But in my opinion, these executives should just be giving the Miami Heat love. I don't hear anyone giving the Miami Heat any credit. I don't hear anyone saying that coach that coach supposed to at least have one coach of the year. It's just all disrespect. And all they're really trying to do is just cause divisiveness. you know. And they're not even celebrating us. They're worried about, oh, well, I don't even think that the Miami Heat need Tyler Hero. Of course we do. He was averaging 20 points in the starting lineup. To me, we're going to definitely need him some way somehow somewhere in this playoff run we're going to need him especially if we have to face the suns again the nba finals which they're saying that if we do make the nba finals he can come back by around that time but let me know what you guys think do you guys think that the miami heat missed tyler hero do you guys think that the miami Heat should trade tyler hero do you guys think that the miami heat play better without tyler hero let me know what you guys think in the comments like share comment subscribe as we continue to push to 2,000 subscribers